Good morning, everybody. Welcome to our daily dose of Success God's Way. This is Erin Harrigan, your hustle with heart and health coach, helping everyone attain results for total health with Arbonne and helping entrepreneurs align results to God's truth. Well, I am coming to you from a beautiful Concord, North Carolina, right outside of Charlotte, where I am attending the most amazing, um, just God uh, connected conference called She Speaks and it is a conference for women who feel called to um, speak, write, and teach on the word and um, for aspiring uh, speakers and book writers and Bible study teachers and just all of that and uh, it is is divine alignment. Um, John 15 1 abide in me and I in you and that is the anchor verse for hustle with heart. So I'm coming to you this morning from James 4, 3, which says, um, you have not because you ask not, because you ask from your passions. Uh, you ask wrongly from your passions. And I encourage you to go read that in many different versions so you can really get a sense of what James is saying. It boils down to this. Very often we are asking God to bless what we want versus <clears throat> asking God for his intention and his direction, and then asking on um, following the Lord. I thought I was, but I wasn't. And um, I, he said, draw a circle around your prayer. And I knelt down in my family room and I drew a circle around myself. And I said, Lord, I am circling in prayer, this one goal that I have. And it was a big and mighty goal, but it was a goal that I thought I had wrapped up. And um, that is a perfect example of you you have not because you ask not because you ask with the wrong intentions because it was not God's intention for me to have that goal but it was mine and um when I look back on it I feel so foolish and shameful and ridiculous but the Lord says do not be ashamed my daughter because you were growing in your faith and I was sanctifying you and you didn't know so consider this um your fair warning and reminder to just check your heart for what you're asking the Lord over um, because maybe that's why your prayer has not yet been answered. It may not be the only reason, but it's certainly a great reason to stop and be sure that your intentions are aligned to the Lord. So get down below. Let me know what you think of this, how it resonates with you. Get on over to Success God's Way. Let us know how we can pray through this with you. Um, and some very exciting news. I um, shared last night on my newsfeed as well as on Success God's Way. Um, that there is a faith and business summit online summit next week it's free and um, I'm on the panel <laughs> so I really encourage you to click that link and view that summit I am so humbled and honored to be part of this panel of experts um, that's gonna be coming to you from the faith and business summit and shout out to Brian J Dixon my friend who put all that together and found me and asked me to be part of it um, so I'll be reminding you but I really hope you'll go check that out um, it's next week it's the faith and business summit and there is a link in success God's way as well as on my news feed so have a fantastic Friday and I will be with you Sunday night for our weekly dose um, so tune in 8 30 p.m. on Sunday at success God's way have a fantastic weekend <laughs>